Overall, I felt the lesson went really well. I was very um, pleased with the outcome. We haven't done a lot of work with number lines other than their number line that's on their name tag that some of them are using for some adding and subtracting. So I felt like their learning extended far past what I thought might happen. So I was very pleased overall with the lesson. A couple of things that I was surprised about but very happy with. One was the students that came up with the idea that the number lines could be extended both ways and that they could see that past 10, they could keep the number line going to 11, 12, and 13. And then on the other end, that they realize um, about negative numbers. So we had talked once before when we were making our addition and subtraction charts um, with the math facts on them about negative numbers. But other than that, it hasn't really come up a lot in discussion. So I was very pleased to see that they could come up with what negative numbers would go next. I was surprised that none of them wanted to do that on the game. I thought some of them might choose to extend it to see what would happen. So I'm hoping that they'll choose at workplaces to play that again and maybe extend it. And one other thing I was surprised about with the lesson at the beginning when we were talking about what number would go in the middle of the number line, and I had one student that came up and said they thought it was a six. So when she explained her thinking, she started counting where the zero was with one. So I saw right away that that was kind of a misconception for her but she corrected when she figured out what the zero was, how to get up to five. So I thought that was interesting that some of them had some different thinking about that. And I also noted, noticed that some students were counting by the ticks on the line, and some students were counting the spaces, which I thought was very interesting, especially with the zero and the 10 being labeled right under um, the number line. So I thought that was interesting and something that we'll have to revisit.